AI medical tools downplay symptoms in women and ethnic minorities? What the heck is going on? JatGPT, Gemini, what? A recent publication in the Financial Times says that artificial intelligence tools actually downplay symptoms and advise on many occasions that women and ethnic minorities might or might not or should or should not go see a healthcare provider for their symptoms. Interestingly enough, the GPT-4 models in Meta's Llama 3, the GPT-4 is the older model, GPT-5 is out now, but they suggested a lot of female patients self-treat at home instead of seeking help. And the most insane part about this is that if you enter these questions into chat GPT and GPT thinks you're uh, Asian or black or a woman and you don't, and you have typos, informal language or uncertain phrasing between seven to 9% percent were more likely to be advised against seeking medical care by the AI models. And my conclusion for all this is that the research that they're training on, the language models that they're learning on is based on white males and not necessarily ethnic uh, minorities. And because of that, they're kind of incorporating that bias that's present in research currently and telling people what they should or should not do. What do you guys think? This is kind of nuts. It's a brand new uh, article from Financial Times. It's kind of blowing my mind. Hopefully Google and OpenAI and ChatGPT and all these other models learn and uh, adjust their settings going forward.